<laughs> For the last five years, we've probably had 5,000 artists come out. They had a hot song with yeah, it. Yeah. They probably got more money advanced to them on their first record than I've probably seen in two or three records of being in a group that was successful. Mm. We signed the little face for twenty thousand dollars. It's four members in Goody Mart. That was five thousand a piece. Our care got ten thousand a piece. Wow. So at the end of the day, we've never had a publishing deal. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. Yeah, we gonna talk. Mm. But what I think about when you saying all of that is um I think, number one, the older generation can learn something from the newer generation and vice versa, meaning like to combine the, the both, I think would make a really true artistry, artist. Right. Because what I think about also, because we've been having that big debate, especially with the comedians, because mm -hmm. right now, you know, you have old school comedians who just do comedy or acting and so forth, but you have these new comedians that come up now, everything mm -hmm. is internet and everything. skits and whatever. Mm -hmm. And the older comedians like Faison Love, who's been on our show, he talks about that and saying that they are not coming up the right way of how the hustle, like what we have, what we do. So they don't look at it like you're not really a true comedian like how we are because we came up the right way and we got the fellowship from the older yeah. to, to that brought us in. you last longer because you build a fan base. If it's gimmicky, it, it's thin. Yeah, but them niggas got that money though. Yeah, yeah. Money, see, see, that's the them whole thing. That's what, 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 the, what the older, <laughs> what the older generation has to understand, and me just being in, in both, the the kids look at it like this: if you can't work and move like the industry, we're gonna call you up. That's right. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Get on out the way, up. You know what I mean? <laughs> but it, like, like if you can get in there and get to moving and. You can get in the studio with Lil Baby or get in the studio with Wayne and do their thing. Then they say, oh, okay, OG, you know how to do that thing. OG, okay, OG. You know what I mean? It's all, the kids looking at you, can Can you keep up with the pace of the business right, right. now? Right. Don't be complaining about how you came up. Can you do the same? If you can, OG, if I can see you doing what, what Country Wayne doing, exactly. what Cat doing, and everybody doing, then you ain't, you, mm -hmm. ain't on, you, you good. You good. That's exactly. Now, see, when you start complaining about what it takes to yeah. be in the situ in the, in the game right now, then man, you need to go on to the house. That's right. You better come with some numbers. That's yeah. how go they on, feel. Go on, go on retire because they look at it like we ain't after the trophies. We right. after the money. Right. Mm -hmm. When we came in, we were after the trophies. trophies. That's right. And it's just a different a different Which way of thinking. Which one more important? I mean, you can have the money, but you got to know what to do with the money. It's a barter. Okay. <laughs> For the last five years, we've probably had. 5,000 artists come out, they had a hot song with yeah, it. Yeah. They probably got more money advanced to them on their first record than I've probably seen in two or three records of being in a group that was successful. Mm. We signed the little face for $20,000. It's four members in Goody Mart. That was 5,000 a piece. Our care got 10,000 a piece. Wow. So at the end of the day, we've never had a publishing deal. So when I look at these kids, it'd be like, boy, they signed your life away, you signed the big deal, and you signed the publishing. Boy, you better work, because you dead. Yeah. <laughs> you ain't got nothing to work <laughs> with. Home money always better. You know what I mean? You ain't got nothing to work with. You ain't gave it all away on your first run. Yeah. So if you don't have another hit record, man, them people sit back and go to the bank. Mm -hmm. well, so yeah. that's what we have to do as elders is continue to teach the youth how to survive and to let them know it's nothing better than a road. Wow. It's nothing better than going out there and getting on stage and taking care of yourself. Now, if you want these new, new kind of artists that want people to call and you make money off the internet, that I don't know how long that's gonna last. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.